Hey, it's Chelsea and today I'm making a tutorial video because I was requested to make a tutorial video and I wasn't quite sure what to do at first. That's why it's taken so long, but I've decided I'm going to teach you how to make a cootie catcher or a fortune teller, if you will. So the first thing you're going to need is a 9 by 11 sheet of paper and scissors. And so the first thing you shall do is not scissors right now. So you should fold the paper in this way. So, yeah. Okay, so you folded the paper like this. Oh, this is what the product should look like. And then you're going to cut along this line. So not too easy to do one-handed so we're just going to do like that <gasps> patchy sorry my cat just made an appearance to the video and it was not too Okay, and so now you have a square or a perfect square if you cut it cut neatly. But I'm not very good at cutting, so it's not as perfect. But the next step is to fold it in half the diagonal way, like this. And once you're done doing this, you're going to have four new triangles. See? One, two, three, four. And the next step is to, after you have your four tri new triangles, is to fold it in half the hamburger way or the hot dog way. It's a square. It's the same. And then the opposite way. So you're folding it in half twice. And this will now make your four triangles four squares. You'll have eight triangles. So one, two, three, four squares. And then the next step is to fold each and every little corner in like this. So that each little triangle matches up to the center. Sorry, I'm not very good at doing this and holding a camera. I'm going to have to put it down. Yeah. This would probably be a little bit more even if I was taking my time. But, yeah. And so we have four triangles again and a smaller square. And the next step is similar to what you just did, but the thing you need to do is flip over. So once again, we have four squares. And once again, you're going to fold back your triangles. really bad one. This is kind of what it should look like. Um, it, essentially, this is what it should look like. It shouldn't matter because if this is a pretty decent one, it's not the best because I'm kind of doing it with one hand. But that's what it looks like. And then the next step, after you folded all your triangles in, is to fold it in half both ways again like you did previously. Which, once again, this is difficult to do. One hand. And then you have these four little triangle things which you will stick your fingers into and then push them together. So it's like this and then push together. And you have a fortune teller. 
So you can open it up and write your little fortunes. And so I hope this video was helpful. Also, go check out my music page, Chelsea28. I normally post my videos there, but for once, I felt like I don't have very many videos on there anyway, so this doesn't really matter. But I felt like I wanted to post something on my first YouTube account, which is what I'm doing. So check out Chelsea28 as well. Both me. But, yeah, this was the first account that I made. All right. Thank you. Bye.